It's an affliction that causes some of its victims to shop in the middle of the night to avoid being seen. Spasmodic torticollis causes sudden muscle spasms in the neck. It can force its victims to shake and rock with their heads turned to the side in tremendous pain. On tonight's To Your Health, Kevin Ralph updates us on a Green Bay woman trying a breakthrough procedure. Okay, my head was to the side, and my head was like this. We first met Sue Brandt in the summer of last year with a heating pad always nearby. This is Sue Brandt today, now using deep brain stimulation. It is typically used to tame the tremors of Parkinson's, but Sue is the second person at University Hospitals in Madison to try it for spasmodic torticollis. I have a little tremor yet right now when I get nervous and stuff like that. But as far as my head, my head is straight. A wire was inserted into the exact spot of Sue's brain that's causing her spasms. A magnetic current affects the way cells act and it controls the tremors. It's not being used widely yet, uh, but the, there are encouraging results from the reports that we have had so far. Dr. Heverly has had great success using Botox to tame the spasming muscles of torticollis patients for months at a time. ST patients battle chronic pain. They have trouble sleeping and may appear drunk because of their unsteadiness. Sue says deep brain stimulation has removed many obstacles. It's just a miracle. It really is. She now drives her car with ease and is finally steady enough to put on her makeup. Kevin Mappa, Action 2 News, Green Bay. Doctors aren't sure what causes spasmodic torticollis, but commonly it strikes between the ages of 20 and 50. 